so any date is by default can have the uh, drill down figure but if you want to create a drill down without any date dimension in that case we have to create a hierarchy this hierarchy we have created called demography hierarchy okay so uh, as we are going to uh, create this particular chart so i'll just show you how to create a hierarchy once again quickly we have created actually remove so whenever you have a hierarchical data like country city uh, country state um, uh, region and then city or not all so here in this customer table we have country uh, state uh, then division city postal code okay or address so we will take all these uh, demographic details to form a hierarchy so that when you see a particular chart you can see that on a specific level say country level then you can go down to the next level to see the next level of hierarchy so that is what we call as a hierarchical data or drill down chart in tableau okay so let's create a hierarchy over here so how to create a hierarchy click on any first field which you want to add as a high level detail so country is my first field which will be there in the first granularity here hierarchy create hierarchy demography so it is being created as a hierarchy now you see the icon of this okay it looks like a hierarchy right the first field here is a country so the second is what state right click hierarchy add to hierarchy demography i don't have to create new one okay i have to just add it then after state we have a division hierarchy add to hierarchy demography hierarchy. city hierarchy add to hierarchy demography then address then then basically your pin code postal code uh, postal code com comprises of a specific region right in a postal code i may have a lot of addresses so i will add a postal code say my postal code is 751010 this is the area of my city okay in that particular postal code or you need my address is a small fragment of that right so i will just add the address which is the extreme bottom most entity okay so this is become the demographic field this is a field actually this is a hierarchical field okay so now i will use a demography to create a chart okay so let's create this uh, in this case um, i um, uh, as line chart suggest i cannot create a line chart without having a date dimension but smartly we can create the create it let's see how we can create i'll just add the, this demography i'll not add any specific field demography to sheet i've added it so by default it is choosing country and country has a geo locations so it is showing in the map actually so i will remove it i'll remove the longitude latitude from here to just add this country and then i'll add country wise uh, customer okay say location wise customer country wise customer or orders so how many orders are there in that particular i will add it double click here so sum of order it should not be sum of order it should be count of orders count of distinct orders because order id order number is just a id so it cannot be summed up okay it's not like a money or not like a revenue not like a sales hello so in this scenario yeah. so i just have added this uh, country and order id in this scenario what chart is satisfying what condition of the chart is satisfying line chart is not satisfying because it does not have the 
date field okay so but still i want to create a line chart so first of all whatever the chart is satisfying as a bar chart is satisfying i choose choose it as a bar chart then i'll rotate it the bar chart is created and it is also hierarchical bar chart if you want to see it just go inside a particular country germany click here okay so each country has states so some of the countries do not have states so basically countries is showing over here it does not have any state in our database actually basically it's there but in our database we don't have any relational states with it but canada has two states here And this particular in USA has most of the states in our database. So if I want to go to the next level, the region, the division. So state has different divisions, and USA, so North America, North America. Probably this is the high level data. After country, there is a division, right? So I can take it to the take this to the next level. Okay, I just can add this division to after country, then state. Let's go back here. Click here. Okay. So once I click the country name, the division is showing against Germany. This is the division. USA, it is North America division. So the data is showing. Now, because first dimension is showing over here, second dimension is showing over here. Each country has one one division now in this level. Now I'll go next. Now you can see whatever the country, this is showing the country, this is showing the division, and this is showing the states, state provinces. In USA, USA North America division, and these are the state provinces. So what next? Go click here. USA North America division. These are all the states, and inside these states, individual cities you can see. Okay, this particular city, it has three states, uh, three uh, cities. Okay. It, this state has three cities and you can again click it and in that particular city you can have a different uh, um, zip codes and then going forward you can have addresses so though it is looking a little Analyze, analyze the data from it. Okay. So we are there in a bottommost level. Now I came to the first level here. I can go back to another level. So we are in the first level. So likewise, now we have just converted this to a date, uh, you know, uh, bar chart. From here I can change the style. I can form it to a line chart. Okay. So this is an automatic type here in the mark. So I can just change it to line. So now it's become a line chart. Even though it, I do not have a uh, time dimension, I can form a line chart. So go uh, click here. Let's create a particular, give a particular color. Orders. Some of order ID. I will just choose it to the count of distinct order ID. Okay, it's showing from these countries. I am receiving such and such number of orders. Right click over here, edit axis, and number of orders. Then seat name will give.
drill down analysis. Okay, BD for drill down. Okay. Demography wise, sales analysis. Now we go for full view and you can go inside. Wherever you have two data points, you can have a line, otherwise it will show the dots. So here we have more than one data points. It's showing line and so on. This is the analysis we can make out of it. So this is what we call as a drill down chart in Tableau.